Uh, well, so you'll be playing perhaps uh, your newfound duo here for well, maybe uh, maybe a month or two or three or well, four. Well, let's see. Let's see. You know, I, I live from day to day. So there you go. <laughs> it's the best way to live. There you go. Yeah, you live for the tell, moment. Tell them how you wound up here and sticking around for a while. Oh yeah, but so I, I I'm in my Winnebago, the pink flamingo Winnebago, and uh, I had a petrol leak when I was in Nevada. And so I ended up coming through the mountains, and then uh, Mammoth was the nearest place to stop for a garage. Right. Garage. So, so you're yeah. at the, let me guess, let me guess, the 76 station. Chevron. Ah, the Chevron. Okay. But they couldn't do it, because their hoist wasn't working, so then Victor, my friend here, uh, got his friend Patrick to come and have a look at it. I waited right. three weeks for them to come and have a look at it. Right. Yeah, All and right. then I, I got to the garage, and then they, they couldn't use the hoist. So it was like absolute, but hey, I met new people. Here. Well, there this is go. it. This right. is it, right? Yeah. And, how did, and so, who who brought you here last night? Victor, right there you here. Go. All right, there he is. Great <laughs> <your head. laughs> Good job, Victor. I was supposed to be anonymous, though. <laughs> That'll never happen with you, Victor. I know. <laughs> you don't know how to stay anonymous. I'm telling mean, myself. Uh, <laughs> Uh, well, it's fantastic. It's, uh, <clears throat> it's so. Okay. Do you like it? Fall from his calling. The fever is high. Wicked wind whispers their moans. You got your demons. You got your desires. I've got a few of my own. your demons, got your desires, I got a few of my own, song 